Okay, hi and good morning to doctor and fellow friends. This is the group presentation of KOB3363. The topic is TV show, The Flavor of the World. We are group seven and my name is Wang Haoyi and my metric number is 205155. Hello everyone, my name is Liu Qianhui and my metric number is 205163. Hello, my name is Wu Qian, my metric number is 204768. My name is Chen Bing, metric number is 204725. Uh, my name is Liu Yang, my metric number is 204847. My name is Li Yang, my metric number is 205000. Okay, this is the content of our presentation. The background, introduction, target audience, the budget for TV show, execution of the TV show, the team, and conclusion. Last page, please. So firstly, it's about the background. So according to the current world, despite the rapid development of electronic media and other social media, food shows on TV have never disappeared from viewers' options. And the audience are still watching TV. The internet, YouTube, and social media are just supplements of traditional media. So based on the popularity of the television and the development of food programs, in our group, we chose the program is positioned as a food themed TV show. And in terms of the food theme, from a global perspective, distinctive cuisines are inextricably linked with different flavors from around the world, blending and innovating to create a new taste. So this program was created to seek out the fresh, hunted and less known ingredient and the food around the world to offer fun and knowledge. Next page, please. Okay, next we move on the introduction. So firstly, this program is positioned as a food variety TV show, title which is The Flavor of the World. This name is designed to indicate the purpose of the program, which is aimed to explore the cuisines of different countries and the connection between them. And for the content, there are five episodes of Flavor of the World, each showing a different country's cuisines, and each episode lasts for two hours. These five episodes are include food from Nepal, Brazil, Mexico, Korean, and Italian. So why do we conduct this program? The highlight of this show is that it includes a variety of food from different sources and categories in line with the new trend of diversified food and the ability to interest how to prepare it. This is a hidden need that is not present in regular food programs, but is a real market. So this is why the program is set up to improve the reputation of the show and increase the audience stickiness. Okay, that's all from me. Next, I will pass to my partner. Okay, this part, I will introduce the target audience. Food loving heart, our TV show includes food from five countries, which can be passed without going aboard. The dishes are rich and unique, perfect in color, flavor, and taste, which can attract many food loving audience. For lovers who want to enjoy wonderful food can save a lot of time and energy through our TV show recommendations and get in touch with the food. Hatering crowd. The hatering industry has evolved to the point where there are many types of food at various price points in different regions and even across um, bodies. How to stand out among the thousands of stores operating in the same way has left the hatering ranking his mind. Our TV show um, capturing the heart of food lovers and as a person in the hatering industry can learn about the taste and the performance of food lovers through our TV show and get some training. The sheer quality of life product. Nowadays, people's material living standards are increasing and their purchase of quality of life is getting higher and higher. And their food equipments are getting more and more elegant. People with a high level of cook purchase can learn how to make it by watching our TV show and following the chief, the chief's steps. Okay, next page, please. This part is the budget of our TV show. 
The cost of our TV show is around 630,000 ringgit, which includes three main costs. Um, gas the studio and the policy Gas the fee of about 350,000 ringgit, includes two hearts, five chips, and the rest in gas. The studio fee of about 200,000 ringgit, includes direction, director, production, recording, studio, lighting, sounds and radio, um, props, screen manager, editing and production. Uh, the last fee is pub uh, publicity fee, about 18,000 ringgit, includes TikTok, Facebook, Inst Instagram, TV advertising. Okay, my part is over. I will pass to my group member. Okay, the next part is process. Uh, firstly, a male host and a female host enter the show at the same time. As then the two hosts begin to introduce today's guests. After the introduction, they begin to introduce today's national food theme and show the local food background and history of the short film. The next part is host invite the sheep who representing their country to come on stage. As the sheep begin to introduce himself and introduce the national specialty food that will be shown today. Finally, introduce the ingredients needed today as the foreign chiefs start to prepare ingredients ready to start to cook. Chief can explain the specific detail and also can communicate and interact with on site guests. After the delicious food is cooked, the next, the next is a testing session. Chinese chief can analyze and evaluate the test after testing. Immediately after work, the rest of the guests exchange view and their experience with foreign chief. Finally, the audience can test and make an evaluation of the dish. The last part is the host make a summary as the show ends as the next preview is played. And about the seating layout will be decorated according to the style of different culture in each issue. For example, the Mexico theme, can, uh, Mexico mirrors as the overall colors mean red, you know what I'm saying? Okay, next part. Uh, the time slows. Uh, the time slow divides three parts. Um, every, Saturday, every, every Saturday, 9 p.m. to 11 p.m., audience have more free time at weekends and young people prefer to watch TV at night more likely to be hungry at night. The next part. Equipment, translators are essential. We need translators to help uh, each chef from different countries to establish a bridge of communication with the audience, host, and the other uh, guests uh, present. Microphones, cameras, and video recorder recorders are also essential for each program. In addition, a separate microphone is needed to collect uh, sound. One is to collect the clearer wo voice of the guest, and the other is to collect the uh, audience response. We also need to prepare a sound box for playing BGM. The spotlight can make the video clear. The large LED screen, a uh, teleprompter, and the static cam are also essential. We need a large screen to play food videos from different countries, which is convenient for the audience to watch. The teleprompter can also help the host to cue the process, and the study cam can help the audience in front of the screen to closely watch the uh, process of making dishes by chefs from various countries. In addition, it is necessary to prepare a refrigerator for storage and the uh, preservation of uh, ingredients, as well as kitchen utensils and the tablewares for audience, host, guest, uh, and uh, etc. to taste the food. That's all for my part. My friend will continue the rest of the part. Okay, this part is for the team. Um, producer responsible for the conception of the program and the development of, of the program. The theme of the program is flavor of the world. Uh, at the same time, we conceptualized the human part of the program, which the football culture and the different regions as the highlight of the program. The show will be a fun and exciting experience for foreign chefs and Chinese chefs to compare their cooking skills while spreading the culture of domestic and international food. About director, its responsibility is to transform the program idea into a program. Um, the, per the person in charge is to organizer of the specific work of the program production specific to how the segments of the program will be carried out. For example, foreign chefs will be invited on stage to personal talk about 
tolerate feature in the documentary and the Chinese chef will discuss together. Compare different national flavors of food uh, made from the same ingredients and so on. Next page, please. The camera team to translate the expression of work into real images. That is to take images according to the requirements of the program. In the shooting of the program, as we are a food program, overall picture style, shading, color, color tendons are included to bring uh, warm tops. At the same time, it is important creative work to choose the right leads and the shooting angles. The chef needs to have a medium shot of the chef making the food and a close-up of the dish when the production is finished. Technical team responsible for all technical aspects of the work, especially the light, lighting setup and the sound debugging. We set up bright lights on the host and the guest set, set situation and the table to deploy the food, ensure that the normal filming images are not lured by the films and that the quality and the clarity of the images are gunned. Debug the microphone volume and the specific effect sound to ensure that the technical part of the error view. The last one is past production team. The scope of what is included in the past production is also very wide. Material collection, editing, art, special effects, all parts have to be targeted according to effect of the program that the director and the producer, producer want to present in line with the term of the program. Okay, that's all for my part. Thanks, I will pass to my teammates. Okay, now we come to the part of points to note and the conclusion. Um, the first point is healthy issues. And there is a need to ensure in our program that the food is healthy, and at least we may need to provide some healthy uh, dietary guidance. For example, our program needs to take into content both the effect and the visual nature of the program. For example, also we always say that the viewing effect of a food is often, you know, opposite to its house. But as the show is targeting uh, at audience from all ages, so for the teenagers whose knowledge of health is not that it's not that uh, enough. So it is necessary to set up clear instructions for people who do not know much about um, scientific concepts. And based on our review of some literatures, we find that uh, guidance on healthy and unhealthy food in cooking programs can obviously affect children's food choice tendencies. And those who watch uh, cooking programs with healthy food are more likely to choose uh, healthy food. And moreover, for college students, TV programs about cooking and nutrition can change students' knowledge about food and healthy, which reminds uh, the program production team to take social responsibility and the uh, educational significance of the program into consideration when making the show. And the second, yeah, uh, turn page, please. And the second point is uh, the safety issues during the cooking show as well. Uh, it is worth noticing that unlike other variety shows, a large amount of flammable and explosive materials will be used in the production of the cooking shows. So this requires the program team to conduct safety uh, inspe inspections of equipment and materials before the starting of this program. And some safety hazards must be investigated before the program is produced. Okay, next page. Uh, okay, now it's uh, the conclusion. So um, based on all the parts that we've explained, basically we've introduced uh, the implementation details and general process of this program. Uh, like we said, it's a TV show that mixes, mixes educational meaning and exposure of a uh, variety uh, of cultures with internment elements. So this uh, and its topic is cooking and food. Uh, and as what we mentioned, our team, our TV show encouraged people to learn about the traditions and history of people from different regions while watching their food being prepared, which means it is also a, a family style show that is suitable for the whole family to sit down and watch together. Okay, next page. Okay, so that's all for our presentation. Thank you for watching.